Former Vice President Mike Pence needed a moment to collect his thoughts when he sat down with our David Muir, saying former President Trump's words during the January 6th attack were reckless. 2.24 p.m., the president tweets Mike Pence didn't have the courage to do what should have been done. It angered me. But I turned to my daughter who was standing nearby and I said, it doesn't take courage to break the law. It takes courage to uphold the law. I mean, the president's words were reckless. It was clear he decided to be part of the problem. Pence was overseeing congressional certification of the 2020 electoral college results when the mob stormed the Capitol, chanting, hang Mike Pence, after Trump berated Pence for refusing to block Joe Biden's win. Videos show Secret Service agents rushing Pence to safety before he went into hiding for more than four hours, while at times rioters were only 40 feet away. Pence has largely avoided criticizing his former boss until now. President's words that day at the rally endangered me and my family and everyone at the Capitol building. We are seeing a full-throated condemnation from the vice president. In his new book, Pence describes the moment he told Trump that he would not block Biden's win. The president laid into me, Pence writes, adding that Trump responded by saying, you'll go down as a wimp. If you do that, I made a big mistake five years ago. Andrew Dimbert, ABC News, New York. The full interview with Mr. Pence airs on World News Tonight, coming your way here in just a little while at 5.30 today. That'll be followed by more coverage on the streaming channel ABC News Live and on Nightline later on tonight.